Uh, oh, everyone, this is all we're hunting on. Industry transporters once again. And we're gonna see if we can get it to work this time, basically. So, the first thing we're gonna need to do is build our store. Food industry. Food store. Let's build a medium food store. Oh, look, now the uh, highlight's back. Okay, so. Just gonna need to deform this a bit. So I'm talking to Marcus a bit, and uh, he saw my video, watched it, and he is taking into consideration everything I said, and we're gonna see how much of it actually he did fix. Come on, you fucker. There we go. Now I got that. So we're going to try for a train set up here. So if trains are working, we're good to go. Alright, so terminals, railroads. Ah, damn. I'm just barely, not too, not close enough. This really does need to be a drag select thing. It's too hard to go back and forth. But he didn't fix fix that problem with uh, he did indeed fix the problem with the uh, UI switching. If you try to build like a rail terminal and switch to demolish and you start I think it was a switch start deforming, switch to build menu, it gets out of that. So that's that's good, that's fixed. That was uh, minor issue, but it jeopardized the game at the same time. Alright, so we got this, it, it is just not smooth at all. One thing I have to say is that if you have a little smoother it would be better. Okay, so I found another bug here. I built a rail on a slope, and then I terraformed it, and now it's just in midair. So I don't know what's going to happen if I try to build again. So we'll see if I'm actually able to go on that later on. Oh, God, it's so hard to build. Another issue right here. Is can't make that turn. I know it's not possible with the current uh, <sighs> current track pieces that are available, but I won't. So I'm just going to clear a big area because I'm tired of this, basically. Alright, so... Hopefully we can come in now. Alright, so... Let's try to just do this. Alright, so we should go. Damn it. Oh man. No way. Way off. And okay, 
right, so now another thing is it looks like, uh, looks like we have indeed, he has indeed fixed, um, So that's not switching to a four-way or three-way junction. I'm trying to go from there. So once it's changed, it can be changed again. So there's an issue. Can demolish this. Fix the rails. They weren't textured. Another thing I would like to show all of you is the large food factory, which indeed was a model that I created, and Marcus went ahead and retextured it because I am terrible at uh, UBW not holding and texturing. But it looks pretty good now. So we co really collaborated on this. Uh, I made the mesh, I made a crappy texture and fixed it. Um, I went back and changed the silo so that they were you know, uh, corrugated metal instead of wood. Oh, it was good. He added smoke to the smokestacks and a flag, and which there's two flags on it. So, an issue. Oh, it looks, it looks good. Fits in the game. Alright. So we're just going to set our production here. Thanks. So now everything is boot based. So the date is going way faster. So then we're just gonna use the UPDX1. And we're just gonna go away from it. So we'll go to here and we'll go to here. And all right, so then we're just gonna do a load. This will be cool to see. Let's see. What's the camera? It's the free camera type. This is definitely cool. Seeing my train pull up to my factory. <laughs> definitely cool. Oh, it's just... Oh, it's really Ooh, I got a... I got a Doppler effect in that. So let's see if we can upgrade how hard it is to upgrade the terminals. Well, let's see. I think we need to see if we're actually selling this stuff. a month. Okay, so let's see how hard it is to expand this terminal. So I would hope that you can build right over. No, So 
Oh, you can't just upgrade a terminal. So I guess you have to replace it. I'm not exactly sure where two trees is going. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, did you see that? Not sure what happened there. I saw it. Let's set another train and see what happens again. Truck terminals, game does not like it. It's, uh, Marcus doesn't seem to have that much of an issue. Delete trees when you're trying to build. It's not tedious trying to go back and forth on that. So here comes another train. So I, I'm guessing what's going to happen here is uh, something that's not too good. So I'm guessing what's going to happen is it's, it's going to hit this glitched rail and then it's going to double back. And it's actually going underneath the ground now. <laughs> it is now going under the ground and it has decided to flip around going under the ground and it's going, going gone. It's just gone. Alright, so we'll try fixing this rail. And I have two trains that are just off the rails. I don't know where they are. But they're gone. Appropriate rail system. Okay, so let's try building some streets here. These streets.
to do it. Now I'm gonna try to just build some. Man, that's really bad now. Prices can't go out. Alright, so let's go to there. Go to there. Alright, so is that road not connected? See if it drops this time. I don't think it won't. So it's already been three months. So that's yeah, that's really bad. Ten months. I'll go buy them. I just played last night and uh, time took about I don't know, it took like four hours, five hours for a year to go by. Maybe it is. So the train did unload, but it unloaded way before the station terminal. And yeah, it looks like the store it says that it only needs 17 per month now, so I'm guessing that a couple of them delivered. I don't know how I can tell if it's been delivered or not. Okay, six out of seventeen. Which they are pretty hilarious to watch. Alright, so I think I can just copy this. It seem like my trucks are screwing up yet. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna kind of cut out here and come on and start I'm gonna keep building up and come back and we'll see what breaks. And in no time at all, it looks like my trucks are stuck just as always. And even this truck, this truck over here was trying to go in and out of the I went out of the terminal again and again. I don't know what it was, it was doing. This flag is now only one flag. I don't know if all of a sudden one flag has disappeared. I'm gonna try selling some of these trucks. I don't know. Every time I try to build trucks, they just get stuck. The runs per month is max. And all it's being told to do is go from here to there. From here to food factory. So I don't know. The train seems to be doing alright though. Well I'm not sure if I can add another train. So I now have these two trains on here, and I'm not sure exactly sure what's going to happen when they hit each other. Can't remember what happens. Um, 
If they'll bounce or just go right through each other. And they did indeed did some weird, really strange bounce there. And this one is just, uh, has just decided to take a stroll through the countryside, as it, as it is. And it's now, uh, delivering my goods to, let's see, it's heading to this town over here. So maybe if I build a store, I can actually capitalize on it going all the way over here. But for now, it's just heading off into the sunset. So that's interesting. Um, but yeah, overall, I mean, got my train, got my industry in here, so that's really cool. It looks really good, actually. I mean, it's kind of low poly, but it's gotta be. Anyway, the other train's fine. And it looks like... Oh, I can actually kind of get like a graph going here. Because we can actually see... Time actually passes now. Uh, sold furniture. I'm not exactly sure why that's going up. Articles. I don't see food in here anywhere. Must be some kind of combined graph. Anyway, I'm Zal. I'm watching the government. I'll be playing as the government. And see you next time.